a CBSC 2011 question it says find the equation of the plane through the intersection of the planes the first equation of a plane and the second and parallel to the x-axis so first of all we have intersection so we are going to follow that method that we studied and that will be regarding lambda so how to find the required equation from here you have the first equation and here r dot n is equal to d so this is the first n this is n1 this is n2 now that will be 1 and here from here it will be 2 lambda so 2 lambda plus 1 because we are going to follow lambda I'm just skipping one step then here it is j and here it is 3 so plus 3 plus lambda j cap then there it is k and there it is minus so you have plus lambda minus 1 k cap then you have plus 4 and there it is minus 1 so that will be minus lambda plus 4 is equal to 0 and this we have to take care that the first equation is here and this is the second equation so lambda will be associated with the second equation so here it will be plus 4 lambda in, indeed and here it will be minus of 1 because this is the first equation now what to do let's name this as equation number 1 also we have been asked to make it parallel to the x-axis so x-axis has i cap as its unit vector so what is i cap here it is like this to 2 lambda plus 1 multiplied by 1 is equal to 0 for parallelity with the x-axis I am again skipping one step in order to make you practice now so lambda is equal to or 2 lambda is equal to basically because this becomes 2 lambda plus 1 so minus 1 lambda is equal to minus 1 by 2 now this minus 1 by 2 of lambda will go above and give me the complete answer which I needed so when you put minus 1 by 2 here what do you get r vector is there and one more thing to be noticed this should not come in a bracket the bracket should close here right 2 lambda plus 1 means 2 into minus 1 by 2 plus 1 which is 0 i cap just remove it 3 minus 1 by 2 is 1 by 2 so just keep, keep it 1 by 2 j cap and one more thing to notice that the given equation had the first equation like this the second like this so we need to change even this thing because the lambda should be associated from what we have to see so the lambda will be associated with the second equation so this will be 3 lambda plus 1 and similarly the lambda will be associated with this second equation so it will be minus lambda plus 1 now when you put it everything equal to 0 by chance the answer does not change because it is related to i cap but please take care otherwise the answer will differ here now this is 0 3 into minus 1 by 2 is minus 3 by 2 minus 3 by 2 plus 1 is minus 1 by 2 and here it is 1 by 2 plus 1 which is plus 3 by 2 k cap now plus 4 lambda 4 into minus 1 by 2 is minus 2 and minus 2 minus 1 is minus 3 which is equal to 0 now just take the LCM so r vector dot minus j cap plus 3 k cap is equal to 6 because this becomes minus 6 goes to the other side of equal to makes it plus 6 and this is the answer this is very important to understand you cannot afford to make a mistake of this sort and please take care that you revise all the concepts and then only miscellaneous problems can be solved with ease